Hey everybody, Rachel here from RachelTheStamper.com and today I'm going to be sharing the Wood Textures Designer Series Paper Stack with you in our DSP Share videos. Now this is available in the 2018 and 2019 Stampin' Up! catalog. It was a carryover item because it was so popular last year. So popular that this is actually my second pack of it, which I absolutely love. Now this is order number 144177 and it is $11 US. And you get four sheets of each of these, which are so, so pretty. Now these, I will tell you, I have a really hard time cutting apart until I actually want to use them. So I haven't cut them up yet. So what I will do is I will show you the flip sides of both, okay? So this one is absolutely gorgeous. This is my favorite one, and it reminds me of my grandfather. Just a ring of wood. Love that. So this is a beautiful piece here. And then I'll go through and show you the flip side. We have some kind of washed out old wood. This is like barn wood. Very, very pretty. This is kind of a little bit more of a light, like in the 90s, a light colored paneling. Very pretty, like a pine. Again, we have another washed out, maybe like an old floorboard. This is absolutely lovely. This is like a, a plank, a pine plank. I love this one. This is probably my second favorite. And then we have another more of an ashy wood. And this one is another favorite of mine. It's kind of like a beachy whitewashed wood with a little bit of scraping at the end. Love that one. Then you have more of a solid piece. Very pretty in color. Kind of like soft suede. This one is definitely a little bit more aged. So this is probably like a little soft suede with some early espresso. And then we have another that is a light pine. It also has the little knots in it. My grandfather never liked the knots in the woods. I always had to pick the wood that didn't have any knots, even though I thought it gave him character. And then we have another medium colored piece of wood. This is very, very pretty. This would be great too if you wanted some sand, maybe in one of your cards, but you didn't really know what to do with it. This edge here looks like a sand dune. And then another really rusty, beaten up wood piece. Very pretty. Okay, so now we're gonna go to the flip side. So again, I did start with where I was before. So this is the one that has the gorgeous tree ring. And this is like, I don't know, First favorite, second favorite. For This is the one I always have the hardest time picking. Love those tree rings. So cool. Okay, and then again, these are pretty similar. So these are, you'd be pretty good with picking either side. So those are very similar, weathered wood. This one goes to more of a, like, yellow. It's kind of got more of a soft, nah, like a crumb cakey coat to it. A little bit more of a yellowish wood. I like this one too, just because again, it's got those beat up marks in it. Really nice. This is another favorite. Reminds me of probably the old floor that is underneath of our house. We had some really hideous carpet in our house because our house was very, very old, but I bet you this is what the wood looks like underneath. So pretty. And this one is the same. They're pretty close in size, but this is a little bit lighter or color, I should say. And again, same with this one, pretty similar. And if you remember for this side, we had the beachy which was near the bottom. And this one is kind of more all over a little scuffed. So again, really nice beachy color. This one, very similar. Both sides are pretty much the same. Okay, same with this, a roughed up piece. So this is kind of nice because you don't really have to choose which side you want. Same with this, very similar. They just kind of move the knots around a little bit, little bigger knots on one side. This one is a shade darker. And it has this nice vein and of color in it. it kind of reminds me of a wine bottle. <laughs> and then this one again. Pretty weathered looking. So very similar in color and hue. So again, that was the Wood Textures Designer Series Paper Stack. And again, you do get four sheets of each. And again, if you have any questions or comments, make sure you leave them in the section below. I would love to hear what you think of this paper. Thanks for watching.